when you came on the show, you hadn't had a bestseller. That was your first book. Uh -huh. Does life change for you once you've had the bestseller? Yeah. Well, you know, the course in Because then your expectation for what the next book will be and the next book will be changes, does it not? A after the next week, <laughs> you're healed of that pretty quickly. Yeah. <laughs> but in A Course in Miracles, it says that for every person, there is a highly individualized curriculum. The idea of the Holy Spirit, the idea that the universe is invested in your self-actualization, which is the same thing as saying the universe is invested in your enlightenment. So you will go through which everything. Which is the same thing as saying God wants you to be enlightened. To be happy, to be in love with life, to be living in love and to forgive and be forgiven. Right. That's all different words for the same thing. And, you, and, and one of the other things is that, and I think everybody who's watching this understands, that this planetary experience is about life lessons. Right. And what you were just saying is that everybody has an individualized curriculum. Exactly. That belongs just to you. That's right. That's yeah. right. So everybody sitting here, everybody watching, what, wherever we're sitting, whatever we're doing, that's it. You know, a lot of times people think, I want another relationship or another experience or another job in order for it to be happening. Yes. But it is our being the people that we are capable of being and the perfect lesson for us to practice being who we're capable of being is whatever is happening right now. Right now. So. Whoa, now. that's big. Yeah, so wherever we are, whatever we're doing. A lot of times people think, you know, someday my path will start, but whatever is happening in this moment is... You're already on the path. Right. But what yes. would you say to people who are specifically coming to this kind of uh, programming? Uh-huh. Yeah. I would say what I say to myself every day, which is, okay, who have you not forgiven? Who are you holding? The Course in Miracles says you can have a grievance or a miracle. You cannot have both. So if I'm thinking with an attack thought towards someone, that means my heart is blocked and they're not suffering, I I'm suffering, suffering. Yeah. because miracles, the idea is that the universe is both self-organizing and self-correcting. Miracles occur naturally as expressions of love. And how do you define a miracle? A miracle is a shift in perception from fear to love. So as long as my heart is open in love, Ooh, so whatever's great. supposed to, it's like a but if my heart is shut, then I'm deflecting the miracle that would otherwise be happening. So when you say, what would I say to people? Once again, okay, who am I holding a grudge? Where am I holding a grudge? Where am I not giving? Because only yes. what I am not giving can be lacking in any situation. Where am I showing up with attitude? Where am I showing up with unkindness? Who am I holding something against?